that they were either fired they were sacked because they were the final one of life. And when they were fired, they went into thinking much about their future. And that's how they started things. Others retired at very tender age. Like the majority of them remained very employed, very faithful. So that was Kiwa and Semekana and Kwamba, those are the best employees. But those are the ones who died poor. In case you are in the employment up to today, there's nothing wrong with that. Continue. But remember one thing. If you have never tested how to earn money when you are sleeping, the chances of dying poor are very high. Are we together? Yes. And I'm here to coach you on how to do that. And it's going to happen. In fact, two years from today, <coughs> one year from today, some of you will be pushing cars and buses type of machines. And they are not many. Ukipita bali kuna police wa mesimabuja na nini. Wata sa, hello sir, hello sir. Hello sir. Because the machines will be driving. It's going to happen. I've seen it a lot. I know my brother here can tell you now that he's driving a machine. <coughs> An employee will measure in selling time for money. Why? Because if you don't sell time for money, that is, you don't report to work, you'll be given a yellow card. That is the warning. And after a few days, it returns to red card. See only Now, for 40 years, what we of the university? Moja. Now, tell me. Now, we red card. Now, that was the only source of income. That's why you hear a lot of people are jumping from 21st floor. We are trying to finish that. Because you will not need to report to anybody's duty to be paid. Never. After sending time for money, while I may qualify for three years and they are engineers and doctors and lawyers, they come and open their practicing offices. Now you have what I Doctors and lawyers, I know we are here. But you can only work with two people, ten or maybe a hundred, and anything below five hundred people working for you, you are still a self employed person. You are still an entrepreneur. It's called self-employed person. These are big business owners and these are investors. So a self-employed person has got one <coughs> mindset that it is not easy to make money. So when these people work in the evening, they have to remain until they lock the office and carry the, the keys because they don't trust anybody else other than themselves. They also sell time for money. They will be selling time for money. How? Because a doctor who has a clinic and is the only surgeon in that clinic, if he doesn't attend office for two weeks, there's no money coming to that office, isn't it? Mm -hmm. See, president come and employee. The difference is only that he does not have journey of growth. He will have, he will own it. He owns the day of it. And I know anybody who is at that level and they gets to hear this might get confused. But my mission is I want to coach you guys on how to move from here to become a big business owner and even from here directly. You need to be here and be invited the way you are invited today. Come and listen. Because I will not leave you or let you get out of this place before you understand how to make yourself great. Those who are doing small businesses of less than 400 people, that is, they've not yet become big business owners. I just want to say one or two things on how to bring them up to that time. For those of us running hardware shops in Kisi Town, most cases you'll find that they have one. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? shop moja. Nani hardware. Now you may just want me to make up at one and nine. Last month, two times you were born during the day. Last month, watch it now. Because it can make for two and nine. Thanks, Amadi. You may just want to change your way of living. In case every day, but we are not going to get that and deserve that money. Now, I mean, we know a bit too. What about five million or more? And they are stocked in one shop. Why? Because 
that person most likely underwent <coughs> formal education, which gave us this kind of education where you learn <coughs> mostly on things which might never take care of you after you finish college or you finish school. Now, if you are to come up, <coughs> we will know how to name parts of an insect. Head, thorax, nailing it. And that is what the teacher is missing. The tallest mountains in Africa, we know there are two. Mount Kenya and Majama. Now you're in a Those are the kind of things. When you finish, you are not likely to learn anything. Now you're in a Makiwa. Those are the kind of things. When you finish, you are not likely to learn anything. Now you're in a Makiwa. Those are the kind of things. You are not learned anything to do with how to increase your business or how to start making money when you are sleeping. That is called formal education. It was there, initially it was brought by the Mzungu so that he could rule Africa and have many employees. They will know how to name parts of a tree and not how to create a machine out of the tree. And the title will be adopted, which is good. Now, having said that, we want to put this man from one hardware outlet on the main road by telling him Rome was not built in a day. You cannot force people from his county to be coming all the way to your shop if you want to sell material. You style up, what do you do? Get to about five corners of Kisi. Open similar outlets. You don't have to do it very fast. After singing on other smith to the Slowly with time, what would I do now is that besides the smith, what else can you sell? And you stop it slowly. Stop every corner. Five outlets in Kisi. And within one year, two years, three years, you have Migori, you have Congo, you have Oma Bay, you have Kisumu, and you have the other nearest town across here, Yamira. So when you have six towns, when you have six towns, where you have five outlets in each, you will not become a small businessman with a mindset of locking the office in the evening and taking the key. Because now you become a man who will take one manager out of the five outlets in this house. And that one man in PC becomes the manager and takes care of every employee when you are not there. And then you have similar things in different towns. So what do you create? A mastermind group of five managers, six managers, for that case, because there are six towns. Six managers, and your six managers become your mastermind group. And the mastermind group is what runs multinationals. You become like a big business owner as you join Aliko Dangote here and the Chris Kirubi. Even in the morning, when they are checking on their shops through phone call, you are also checking yours. And you become a big business owner. What did you do? You did something which did not go by formal education. All these things have been told here. And the things I'm talking about, I learned them through somebody called Robert Kiyosaki in this book, <coughs> The Business of 21st Century. You can't read this book and remain a small business owner anymore. It will coach you on how to open outlets so that you can have a good <coughs> life. And Liko Dangote has got 18 cement factories in different countries in Africa now, 18 different countries. The Kenyan concern has been rated number one. But Aliko Dakote has not been here maybe for three years or more. It is run by mastermind group. <coughs> of who? Six departmental heads. Human resource manager. He can hire and fire people earning more than a million. The financial controller. He can negotiate for a loan of a billion without having to consult Aliko Dakote. So what does he do? He will pay you very well so that you can run his companies in his absence. So you are a mastermind group which will take care of companies. How do you get to know that? Not from formal education. In formal education, you need to read one book. Things fall apart. That's what it is. And then, Mr. Abbott, that is for physics. And then, I know you know for biology, I don't know. It has a name. And those ones will never bring you here to create a mastermind group. It is only when you go to 
self-education. And the books you are reading are talking about real life, how you make money. Mm. But not your maneno ya. River Nile starts from ginger, and it ends up where? In the Mediterranean Sea. See how I do it? The police are doing it. Now, see how much they are trying to do it. Now, I know River Nile starts from ginger. Lake Victoria. The next thing we will see in the police was here. Was here. So, having said that, guys, I want to show you now how you can create a system. And the system works for you when you are away. You do not have to report anywhere. And for that matter, I want to coach you this. Remember, we started Novatech in 2019. And when we came on board, I'm going to talk about Novatech later. We agreed on one thing. We are in forex trade. What is forex trade? You were shown by my brother. Have you understood that we cannot do without forex trade? Do you know that the business we are doing, what we are doing was dependent? We give our definition of pussy, we give our definition of Yet to last my time there. Why? Because where is it going now? Dubai. Now, of course, it's near here. See, you hear This is called Viram. Now, one Viram is 35 Kenyan shillings. Come on, here in 50, you can tell how much money I'm carrying. Hmm? At the airport, Dubai, you will be asked by immigration officer, do you have foreign currency with you? You say, man, you've got a 50,000 here in Kenya. You can tell me what you can do with your shirt. You can tell me what you can do with your now you tell you because you must have a currency of the country where you are going to. That is what you call for exchange. To copper money. Come on, Neta, copper belt. Dollar, Kitwe. Those are the towns called copper belt of Zambia. You must have for Zambia as much. This is a real business. <laughs> Now when you know that ever, maybe it's like you put it, put it in. This is fifty <coughs> uh, Hong Kong dollar. Now more than one dollar and fifty Kenyan shares. So you can tell this is over two thousand five hundred. Give the oppressor who just near Hong Kong. Oppressor who's friend. Now he. See you now. You are coming to my door. In my door. <coughs> oh, it's <you know? coughs> And then, um, no, US dollars, we don't need them. Yes, keep over to these countries. Now, in the Apollo, neighbors, you can't achieve it. Don't mind about the value. <laughs> Now here we are China. You cannot purchase things for your supermarket without you doing You must require, you need to do it. How do you want anything for your supermarket? Okay, now Indonesia, where's the island you are buying? Those are the places where people take their wives on holiday. Yeah? And you are, after you are trained, you can definitely take your wife there. Now, here in Naitua, Ripu, the best are in Indonesia. The best islands you get them there. You need to win. And then Philippines, Filipina. <coughs> this is for extreme. Every, every time you are changing this money, and this one, dirham. South Africa, US dollar. And then, Mafaranga. Niawapi? Ah? 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 Rwanda. Rwanda. And then Malawi, it's called what? Malawian? Watch out. And then Nigeria, it's called Nigerian what? It's called a movie. I give it here. That is a photo of my Now, because movie has created the biggest number of poor people in Africa. In fact, I coach you all to be the one to be watched on TV. The times have appeared on TV. Sometimes I look at it and when I know people are watching, I tell myself, one time I used to watch TV, but when I stopped, now I'm being watched. I'm together. It's going to happen. 
Don't worry how. Why do I want to show you? Because we are in a business called Innovatech. What do you do in Novatech? In Novatech, I want to show you how you are going to create a system. Forex trade is exchange of currencies across the world. And when you are importing your goods from Shanghai, you must pay them in Chinese yuan. When you're importing your cars from Japan, you must pay them in yen. In yen, isn't it? Now, if that is going to happen, then there must be people who will provide that currency, and those people are called traders. Now, why they want to trade in small amounts of money? They are even trading here in this town. So, what want to do our training on how to trade? When you plan how to trade, you will be trading on 50,000, 100,000, and the like. And you can make a lot of money. You can start in the morning with 50,000, and by evening, you are 400,000. Let me tell you that. <coughs> You can start a trade in the morning with 50,000, and in the evening, you have made more than 200,000. Then you'll be tempted to do it again and again. But the problem is, when you are a small trader, you are not controlled by anyone, you are not registered anywhere. So the chances are, when you cheat people and take their money to trade, when the market forces which determine what you earn are not good or in your favor, then you are wiped out, you lose everything. Why for what I want to see our Kisema Akoma? I fear forex because my grandmother lost everything. It's okay. And then she had to lose, otherwise what else was to lose. Now, the truth of the matter is, when you are a small trader, you will definitely be independent and nobody controls you. And for that matter, you will this is a small trader. He will trade on 100 percent of all his money, and he will lose all of it one time to zero percent because he's taking all of it. But who is the other type of trader? The one who gives us this money when we are importing huge volumes of money. That must be a big trader, and he trades on billions of money. He must be registered. He's called a broker. He must be registered, must, on platform called MT4 or MT5, and he must be controlled. He will never be allowed to trade on more than 10% of the entire money is put on the trade. Why? Because the, con the people controlling, like in Kenya, we are controlled by the authorities. Amen. Now, if you fall under CMA because you are in Kenya region, they will never allow you to trade on more than 10%. And then they must make sure, when you go to MG4 platform, check on the registered traders for Kenya. And you find names like Jim Nambaru, James Wandi of EPT, um, what do you call the owner? Munga of EPT, Jimmy Wanjiki, Mike Songo. Did you know? None of you Moses Kuria. Senior, among all those people, they are big time traders. They trade on billions, but they don't trade themselves. The trade, the trading is done by their professional traders who are Koreans, Japanese, Chinese, and they are here in Nairobi. What do I mean? You want to go to the house? And all those guys, none of them will make less than 50 million a day, 100 million a day. I'm just telling you the truth. But do they ever say, never. Why? Because if they tell everyone and everybody becomes rich, will they be respected? No. So they want to keep it quiet, which is okay. It is called creating a cartel, and it's okay. But unfortunately, you guys are here courtesy nobody. Nobody is an establishment like them. But registered not in Kenya, not in Africa, but in the United States of America, Florida, and registered in Estonia. That is for Europe, European market. What we did, because and when you cannot understand how to answer questions, people will not understand you. So you better be very keen in understanding. Write it in your mind. Write it in your mind. 
In 2019, that was after we had done crypto trading for quite some time. We were not trading, but we were mining. We were mining Bitcoin. What is mining of Bitcoin? For those of you who have heard of crypto, every time you are transferring Bitcoin from uh, my browser, every time Jack is sending some money to my browser, yeye atakupatia wallet yake. Na wewe kutoka kwa wallet yako, utaenda place in a police buy or sell when they sell. Then once you press the button, it will say, where are you selling this? Then you will be given the wallet by herself. So, utatuma, maybe a hundred dollars for wallet yake. Na ikiingia sasa hapo kwako, it is in the air, ikija kwake, in between, some bitcoins are produced. And those bitcoins which are produced, they can be made real by using a mining machine, Z11 um, and S12. Once you have those machines, they will tap the bitcoins produced when you are transferring bitcoins. That's all. That's mining. That's mining. Mining is your better team. Mining in the machines. Very important for you to know. Just for the sake of knowing, you don't have to know much in the beginning. Prof was not being in a day. Now, I'm surprised that you are a member of this past week. Yeah, But you understand it. Now, we did it up to 2018, and 2019 is when this company now was being bought. So, when we came into forex trading, we were lucky because some of the directors were in IT and they were able to get us professional traders. And we came in with some amount of money. I can tell you when we were starting, we came in together and we agreed. Some people will come with $300. Some people will come with $500. Some people will come in with $2,500. These are the packages of starting. The Yoram Kifundo. Then $5,000. Then $10,000. Then $25,000 and $100,000. This is how we started. And our Waliwa Builders runs Evo, Evo, a, 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 a platinum, a gold, platinum, silver, VIP president. Simbako and Yirim Nayo, Simbashika is titles. When we came together, we to go to buy and did this. Then to Kasema, we are going to do this business on leveraging terms. How? For those of us who have come, Pesayetu will be traded on and we will get approximately 4% every week. <coughs> the company could be left with 5 or 10% because they are the ones employing the professional traders. They are the ones giving us the platform, and they are the ones also purchasing the artificial intelligence robots. Because all professional traders are trading together, hand in hand, with artificial intelligence. And that is what you call robots. That's what happens. Now, when they are trading, the company is paying them. So the company, when they are giving us 4% out of your money, they will be left with this. Now, the most interesting part. <coughs> We knew that we did not, as a company, have a lot of money, but we needed to earn money from people by bringing together monies and they create a pool. Create a pool. We created a pool, and immediately, like myself, I came up with my daughter's account here, because you can't open two accounts. So if you want to do two accounts, don't even go out and ask anyone. You have to bring in your mother, your father, and by the way, you have to do the business. You have to do the business. You have to do the business. I got my daughter and I did an account for her. I gave myself and did mine at 500, one account. And my friends did theirs. But then, we agreed on one thing. Every Friday, when the company trades on your money, you will be paying roughly 4%. But if you can talk to your sister who understands that you are making good money, then she comes on board and you talk to another person. Every time they come on board, you will be paid in seven ways. 
and that is leveraging as per America. America, all of them live on leveraging. If you want to know the biggest supermarket in the world, it's called Walmart. And the founders are some of the richest billionaires in the world. And every time you go to that supermarket to purchase anything, they will ask you who invited you, who told you that we exist. Now, we, when you purchase, Hanatumio again. They actually create an account, and every month, some money is sent to that person. And that's how it's the biggest supermarket in the world. Because every time you are there, you will be adding some money. Why should you go to neighbors when there is nothing? How would you get Leveraging is what happens in the entire America. Now, in this way, when I came with my $500, I invited some friends. I invited a guy from South Africa who came with $10 million. I was paid 5%, which is $5,000. And that in Kenya shillings is $600,000. It's the good money. Now, in Yango, the OE2, there are 60,000 Kenya shillings. So, the belief was 600,000. I invited a guy from America, Abdi. He only got my name from somebody. And he called me. When he called me, I took him to the business the way I'm taking you now. And he told me that he understood. But I still sent him to our Florida office. And I told him to go and learn more. When he understood more, he also gave me 10 billion. And I was paid another 600,000. If you met me then, I started working differently. And then he took a one who went to the Because the professor. And I started with only $500. Now, when these people are being paid their money every Friday, return on investment, which is roughly 300 to 400,000, a certain percentage, check matching, comes to me. And that is, every one of them with their 10 million, I will be getting every Saturday 20, 25,000. You need to understand that with your good investment, you will number one going to earn very good return on investment and you might not require anybody to join you. Niko Nawaria for America 100 million. Niko Nawaria America 50 million. They are earning 1.5 million to 3 million every Friday. Do they need anybody? In fact, this guy from America, he increased his amount to 100 million. And that way, the amount of money I get from his account a lot because of check matching is between 150,000 and 200,000 every Saturday. Then you know now, some Saturdays I get 2 million, some other Saturdays I get 3 million, some Saturdays I get 4 million. Now it's even going to 10 million, I can tell you the truth. But let me coach you on how this money will become yours. You need to start with the little you can. But you need to bear in mind that if you can start compounding that money, within a period of three years, four years, five years, your 50,000 will definitely be more than 100 million. And that's how Americans are rich. Why? Because they all go into forex, but they invest and they keep quiet. They, some of them are leveraging, some of them are not leveraging. If you have only started with 50,000, and within a period of five years, you have more than 100 million. So you have a million for a couple, so you need to have more. You go to that one, you can only say it for a year, you can say it for more than a year. You can pay 7 million. Now let's look at 100 million. You can only say, can you move out tomorrow? You can pay 10 million. So you have a school. Now the time when you have a school, because when you make this kind of money, you change who you are. And you have a car, and I find you have Bill Gates. Bill Gates, 17 neighbors for beach valley and a car, and you want more water. The 17 other neighbors from this side. Because most billionaires when they are sleeping, our attacking is here when I'm here in your city. Why do you want to put more copies of women? And that is what you are going to do when money comes. And money is going to come! You know, sometimes when you hear somebody talk and then you are looking at him, he's, he's looking like he has made money. I was one time having now nothing, but I came across somebody who talked to me the way I'm talking to you. And I want you to start believing in one thing that it's going to be you next time. Yeah. And it will start from where we are. Thank you. Nikona wengi nilianzisha chini kabisa. 
na leo wako much more healthy. Ngoja. Thank you. Nimesha kutoka just one as a request.